And it's, it comes from a concept called eliciting values. And I read about it. I wanted to figure out how can I use this. And this is how I use it. It's three questions that will allow me to get to know you better than asking you what you do or who you are or where you're from. Really simple. Um, if you had to pick one quality that you need to have in your life in order to feel like life is worthwhile, what would that quality be? Something, just something you need to have. can be tangible, intangible, whatever. Integrity? Integrity, cool. Speaking of the mic, just so. Integrity? Thanks. Said with integrity, too. Awesome. So if you have integrity in your life, what kinds of things does that allow you to do in life? Uh, it allows me to build friendships build and friend. relationships with people that uh, also have integrity. Cool. Awesome. So let's just paint a perfect case scenario. Let's, let's just say that you might have this in your life now or maybe later, that you not only do you have integrity, but you're known as a person of integrity. If someone mentions your name, they say, that's a person with integrity. And it's allowed you to build amazing friendships, amazing relationships. You've gotten what you want from the community and from, from women. You're dating or married to somebody with integrity. All your friends have integrity, and you live a life with this? I'd like to think so. Yes. How would that make you feel inside? How does it make you feel inside? It makes me feel very good. Very good. Go and, go and, I'm just going to push you a little more, but what's okay. the actual feeling you get? Um, I feel good when I look at myself in the mirror. Right, but and but describe the, when you look at yourself. Okay, you look at yourself in the mirror. You see that person with integrity. What's the actual emotion that you feel inside? It's hard for a guy to get emotional, but here we go. We're breaking this man down. I uh, I get that comfortable feeling. The comfortable inside. feeling. All right, I that's what have, you're about. I don't have that empty feeling inside. That's what you're about. That's who you are. You're not really about integrity. What you're about is getting that comfortable, not empty feeling inside. That's what you're looking for in life. It's not just in integrity. It's in women, in life, in your job, in your future. And it's funny. As he spoke it, as he actually went in and felt that feeling, you'd actually see him smile and feel it, right? You felt it for a second. Yeah. It's cool. Right. We just fulfilled his life goal in like three minutes. You, you can die now. It's done. It doesn't get better. <laughs> but, Thanks. But seriously, one, one quick thing before you leave, which is when you have to make your decisions in life, right? You have to ask yourself about a job, about a person, about a girlfriend. What's going to bring me closer to that feeling of uh, that non-empty, comfortable feeling? And what's going to take me away from it and avoid what takes you away from it? And, go toward what brings you toward it. So that's cool. Excellent. Thanks, man. Thank you. <laughs> That'll be $10. <laughs> Thanks. So, uh, uh, you guys, you're too nice. Yeah. You're too nice. <laughs> um, but I don't think I have to, By the way, every, everything I just told them is everything I'll say in the field, even the little joke where I say, we fulfilled your life goal, you can die now. That's all. That's, every, that's, every, that's exactly how it's done. Do you want me to break it down for you guys really quickly so you can do it? Yes. Does that help? Yeah. Now, here's a little thing. I have something I call rooting. If you just jump out with like the funny little jokes, then you're, you're just a weird guy who's probably re re heard a joke at a seminar and is going out to try and learn his funny joke to entertain people in a bar. <laughs> but rooting is the idea of why are you asking it? When a stranger comes up to you in, on the street, the first thing you think is, what do you want from me? So you say, well, my niece came over the other day and she did these tricks on me and I actually fell for it, so I want to see if I'm stupid or not. Now there's a reason why you're asking and it's fun. If you just bust out with it like the fun guy with a bar trick, you lose. Right? So keep in mind that it's not this material, it's how you're doing it and how you're presenting it and the reason why you're doing it. So make sure you always root it in a reason why you're asking in that moment. So you're not the fun guy with a cheesy bar trick, get me away from him. Um, so this is uh, uh, Styles EV, Eliciting Values. The first question you ask is, if you, uh, if you, what do you need in your life? What one thing do you need in your life in order to feel like life is worthwhile? It's a great way to get to know people. It really is. And it's amazing because we could have talked for hours and hours, but I feel like we all know that guy pretty well now. Uh, so what do you need to have in your life in order to feel like life is worthwhile? And now, sometimes you're going to go out, and that could be a deep question for some people in a club. Your backup question is, what do you like doing? You know, if somebody's too ADD to, to focus on something abstract, what do you like doing? Second question is, and remember their words. Second question is, if, the first question is x, so x equals the first question. If x, some of us are engineers and computer programmers, so we like formulas. So x is the first question. If x, then what does that allow you to do? In other words, if you like um, integrity, if you have integrity in your life, what, is that, what kinds of things does that allow you to do? And again, if you get the shallow ADD person if, and they say they love dancing, Say, describe your perfect scenario of dancing. Describe the, the best time you ever had dancing. So your backup question is, describe your perfect scenario of X. 
I know I'm going fast, but you guys can always buy the DVD. <laughs> um, your last question is, and this is, the, this is the important one, if X and Y, and repeat their words back to them so they can remember, integrity means something really deep and specific to him. So if you say if you're proud or if you're happy or if you're honest, that's not the same to him as integrity. So repeat his words back. If X and Y, then how does that make you feel inside? And don't let him get away with, I'm glad that he was a little resistant at first. Don't let him get away with, oh, I feel good. Really make him explore that feeling and give that word. And that word is what they call their core value. That's what someone's really about. You know, people in LA, they want to be actors and they want to be famous. And they think they want to be famous, but that's not what they really want. Maybe they want that non-empty, you know, full, comfortable feeling. So once you, once you hit that, and if they've never gone that deep, it's an amazingly bonding, fascinating, interesting thing. I love it. I do it on my friends. It's really awesome.